Do you worry about having enough money to last throughout retirement? Give Reed Potter at Raymond James a call. Reed has 26 years experience helping folks enjoy their best life in their retirement years. The Southeast Kentucky Chamber of Commerce had an eventful 2023 filled with innovation, connection, and a focus on the region and its people. With so much growth in the past year, the Chamber is looking to continue that theme going into 2024. Programs and Media Manager Katie Belt recaps the Chamber's accomplishments from 2023. For this year, the name of the game for the Chamber was growth. Um, we grew in board members, we grew in employees, um, Some, and we've had some really great events which have shown that we've had in increased attendance as well. Um, we've had a monthly membership meeting every month. We've had Hillbilly Days, of course. The Hillbilly Days Festival was, um, was a great experience. We had about 430 people attend our annual awards night this year. We're really excited about that. So like I said, for 2023, the name of the game was growth, and that's something we're looking forward to next year too. While there is much to be done to prepare for next year's Chamber events, the team is confident about meeting expectations. Helping the region grow is their priority. One of the big things for the Chamber is that we don't see county lines. We have a regional approach to doing business in the community. Um, we, we see larger than just the county that we're in. And we want to bring the, the region together um, to boost economic growth across Southeast Kentucky. We're just really excited to see what's in store for next year. Um, we're going to continue some of the great programs that we have going on, you know, National Civics Bee with um, the Excellence for Education grants um, and for the Work Ethic Award. You know, we're just, we're really invested in the Southeast Kentucky region and we just want to see everyone succeed and we can only do that if we're doing that together. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.